Hey guys, how's it going? Tom Fernandez here, and today, guys, I'm going to be talking about creating a follow-up series of emails when somebody opts in uh, to your lead magnet or your giveaway. Uh, the importance of this is that you want to make sure that after somebody opts in, that you offer them something so you can gain their business. They become a client or recruit or whatever it is that you're looking for. Now, before I get started, I want to make sure that you guys hit the subscribe button if you're watching this on YouTube. Once you hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell so you get notified every time that I post a new video. So let's get right to it. So I use a program called AWeber. As you guys can see here on my screen, I'm logged into my AWeber account. Now with AWeber, once you log in, um, you already set up your landing page. You've already set up your sign up form. And what a landing page and sign up form is, that's where people put their name and email, email to get the offer. Well, once people put that, you typically have a tag associated with your landing page or your sign up form. What that means is that, that that person who opted in for your lead magnet is now tagged so that you can start up your follow up series. So how do you start up a follow up series? So I'm going to show you a real basic way of doing so. So the first thing you want to do when you log into AWeber is you go to messages on the left. Once you hit messages, you go to campaign. Once you click on campaign, the next step is create campaign. As you can see here, um, there's different type of uh, you know, templates that you can use for your campaign. So let's just go and click on welcome series just to kind of get it. Once you click on welcome series, it's going to allow you to name it. And we're going to name it lead magnet template. You hit create. Once you hit create, um, it'll allow you to go into the editing where you can edit your follow-up series. As you can see here, since we used the template, there was already some things going on. So the first thing you can see on box number one, it says start campaign on subscribe. So that's a trigger. So what happens is when somebody does something like a go into a sign-up form and they request something, it automatically knows when to start a follow-up series. So here I'm going to hit replace trigger here on the right and I'm going to do tag. So let's say that my sign-up form, there was a tag specifically on that sign-up form that said, you know, free giveaway. So what happens is now that tag is placed here on the follow-up series. So the follow-up series knows to begin when you get that new person who opted in for the lead magnet. So now that I put that there, that's step number one. So step number one is basically saying is, you know, how is this going to start? Is this going to start when, you know, a person just subscribes or is it going to start when, you know, there's a tag applied? In this scenario, I do it when a tag is applied. Step number two is, as you can see here on the left hand side of this, um, this, software there's three things that you can you can basically drag and drop into the the middle of, of the uh, of template you can do a send a message you can do wait or you can do apply tag now obviously apply tag is the first thing that we did there as you can see here in box number two this is a waiting period so what is a waiting period so whenever you have a follow-up uh, series of messages what that means is it's a set amount of messages over a period of time set in order for you to follow up with that person. So typically what I do is as soon as that person subscribes, I wait a day and then after I send them their lead magnet, I start the follow up series after one day. So as you can see here, you can go onto the, the follow up and you can actually customize it. So you can see here on the, white, the, the right side, I can change the wait interval intervals from you know one day to a few minutes to hours to weeks to months so I can customize you know when I want my next message to send whenever I want however I want so typically I wait one day so the first message I usually send is just an open cold message hey how are you doing thanks for you know opting in for the free lead magnet so this is you know, day one after they already opted in, they already got their free lead magnet. And it's just me saying, hi, welcome again. Appreciate you opting in for the lead magnet. Then that's message number one. So as you see here in box three, that's a, a specific message that you have there. So if you were to click on that, 
you can see here on the right it says send message this blue hyperlink is where you would insert and you would customize that message so you would type in uh, here once you click on the blue hyperlink you would click on and you would uh, customize this specific message to your liking so you enter you know you customize the email obviously where you put your, your logo uh, any other pictures or anything you need and then here in this area you just type out hey whatever verbiage you want hey just want to welcome you so so message number one as I mentioned you guys before is is the actual just opening hey it's I'm just sending them a general kind of cold message uh, about if they're open once I'm done with that I usually go and I wait two to three days to send the next message so the waiting period here in box number four I would go there and I would change that and I would go two days right so in box number four I wait my second message to them is about two days later and that message usually is just a just a reminder of whatever my offer is hey you know you opted in for uh, you know my free you know checklist I want to make sure that you have the ability uh, that you know you get a discount on this product as well so it's one of my offers so whatever you're offering them on the second message usually that's where I send it just reminding them hey because you opted in for this lead magnet now you have the opportunity and you can put whatever your offer is so remember that when somebody opts into a lead magnet your follow-up series is offering them what your your service is you already gave them something for free they have a good taste in their mouth about you now you can give them an offer right so message number two two or three days later is giving them the offer so that would be this message in box number five right then the next thing I do this is typically three four days later after the previous message is I just give them some value so what I'll do then is I'll take the weight I'll put it here at the bottom and I'll put four days later after the previous message and then I'll take a message here and I'll go down and I'll put it here at the bottom and this message I call it my value bringer um, I may do an article I may do my five tips just just so that I don't uh, constantly hound them with the same offer the same everything it just may be hey here's an additional five tips on you know whatever topic is of your industry whatever it is that you, value that you're providing for them then once I send them that I add another weight tag here at the bottom and this one would be another three to four days and it'll be another value bringer so I'll add another message to this and this one in particular will be a message basically you know with another you know some tips or or something of value else that that they can learn something from so I'm already leaving a good taste in their mouth and now you know they're like wow you know this this is some good information so the last but not least the last thing what I would do maybe four or five days later after my last message is the last thing that I would do is I would do my takeaway so my fifth you know my, my fifth message in this series is gonna be hey you know I definitely understand um, you know, you're not interested in this offer this offer is expired so throughout the process of my five you know the for four previous messages I did an open code and I, I mentioned the offer by the way you have access to this offer if you want to take advantage of it um, then I wait two to three days then I you know give them a gentle reminder hey by the way this offer will be expiring this this day just, want them, just don't want you to miss out then messages three and four which is three to four days later I got my third message which is hey just want to provide some more value so I give them some tips I don't mention the offer my fourth meth message is another value bringer some more tips something um, informational which is three to four days later off after the third message and then my final message is just, hey, you know, your offer is expiring. I just want to let you know, it, you know, it's not going to be available after today. So after those five messages, whatever I'm offering them, um, they should either, um, you know, take advantage of it because it's the last message or maybe they're not interested. So I wanted to share this with you because um, programs like this, like AWeber, have intricate technology and automation that you can use 
to create follow-ups for your clients whenever they opt in. So anytime that you have an email service and you're giving something away or somebody subscribes to your email you know, account or to your, to your channel, well, that's an opportunity for you to create an extensive follow-up series that's automated. So the automation is doing all the work for you. And what happens is you get, you know, sometimes, and I'll give you an example. Sometimes, you know, my business, people schedule appointments with me. That's typically my offer. Hey, I'll give you a half hour, you know, consultation where you can learn more. And that's where usually I sell them is in the call. But usually my follow-up series is, hey, by the way, for taking advantage of my, you know, whatever lead magnet I gave them, you have a free 30 minute phone call. Take advantage of here's the link to schedule that call. Then the next message, you know, two, two days later, just a reminder. Then the third message, three to four days later, is a value message, just providing value to them. Then three to four days later, another value message. And then finally, a takeaway. Hey, this offer for the free, you know, coaching call is expiring tonight. Please click below if you want to take advantage of this offer. So I hope you kind of understand how that works. And by the way, if you're not using an email service, AWeber is very easy to use. As you can see, I just walk you through the steps. They uh, click below in the description area. I actually have a 14 day free trial where you can uh, utilize this for your business. And the great bonus I'll give you for that is if you want some help setting up some of this stuff, I can help you. Uh, you know, one on one where I can teach you a little bit about how to set up some of these things there. Uh, so appreciate you guys for jumping on. If you haven't subscribed to our YouTube channel where we post tons of videos like this, as always, your success is important to me, guys. I'll see you guys out there in the field.